there, I'm Dr. Megan Ross, a naturopathic doctor and functional genetic consultant specializing in chronic inflammation, detoxification, and genetic-based nutrition. Collagen peptides are everywhere, advertised as a miracle for skin, joint, and gut health. But what if I told you that for some people, collagen might actually be fueling anxiety, inflammation, and even sleep disturbances. This isn't just anecdotal, it's rooted in genetics and biochemistry. If you've noticed feeling anxious, restless, or inflamed after taking collagen or protein powders, you're not crazy and you're not alone. Today, I'll break down why collagen and fast-absorbing proteins may be backfiring for certain individuals, the role of key minerals like magnesium and B vitamins in balancing neurotransmitters, and what you can do instead to support your health without the unwanted side effects. Collagen is a protein powerhouse packed with glycine, proline, and glutamic acid all beneficial for tissue repair. But here's the catch, the glutamate overload problem. Collagen contains glutamic acid, which your body converts into glutamate, a neurotransmitter that excites your brain. For some people, especially those with genetic mutations in the GAD genes, GAD, their body struggles to convert glutamate into its common counterpart known as GABA. Too much glutamate equals overstimulation equals anxiety, irritability, and sleep disturbances. A 2019 study in Frontier in Neuroscience discusses how glutamate and GABA dysregulation is linked to mood disorders, especially in individuals with GAD1 polymorphisms, also known as SNPs. The good news is your body has natural pathways to convert excessive glutamate into common GABA, but these processes depend on specific nutrients. Key nutrients for glutamate to GABA conversion include magnesium. It acts as a natural glutamate blocker at NNMD receptors, reducing excitotoxicity, helps calm the nervous system, reducing anxiety, muscle tension, and restlessness. Best sources include pumpkin seeds, spinach, almonds, and dark chocolate. B6, also known as pyridoxal 5-phosphate or P5P, essential cofactor for glutamate dehydrocarboxylase, the enzyme that converts glutamate into GABA. Deficiencies in B6 can lead to heightened anxiety, mood swings, and poor sleep. Best sources include wild-caught salmon, grass-fed beef, bananas, and chickpeas. Zinc and taurine. Zinc supports neurotransmitter balance and GABA function. Taurine acts as a GABA receptor modulator, promoting relaxation. Best sources include oysters, grass-fed beef, turkey, shellfish, and eggs. Without these nutrients, the body struggles to regulate glutamate, leading to anxiety, insomnia, and inflammation. Another overlooked factor is histamine intolerance. How does collagen contribute to histamine buildup? Well, high histamine sources, bone broth-based collagen supplements often contain high levels of histamine, especially when cooked for long periods. Two is the gut microbiome activity. Certain gut bacteria break down amino acids in collagen, triggering histamine release in the digestive system. Genetic histamine sensitivity. If you have a DAO or HNMT SNPs, your body may struggle to break down histamine efficiently, leading to anxiety, skin reactions, bloating, and headaches. Research spotlights a 2020 study in nutrients highlights how gut dysbiosis can worsen histamine-related symptoms, particularly in individuals with genetic mutations affecting histamine clearance. Symptoms of histamine overload include anxiety and panic attacks, headaches and migraines, skin rashes, itchiness, and digestive discomfort known as bloating and acid reflux. As a functional genetic consultant specialized in chronic inflammation, I've worked with hundreds of clients who unknowingly make their symptoms worse with fast-absorbing proteins. Here's why I pull collagen and protein powders from my clients' protocols when they're struggling with chronic anxiety, gut dysfunction, or inflammatory issues. Rapid absorption overload. Unlike whole food protein, collagen peptides and protein powders are hydrogelized, meaning they absorb incredibly fast. For people with inflammation, SIBO, or a sluggish liver, this can overwhelm metabolic pathways leading to anxiety and overstimulation, blood sugar imbalances, and increased inflammation. Best whole food sources of collagen include bone broth, provides minerals, gelatin, and gut healing compounds without histamine overload. Always opt for a shorter cooked broth. 
chicken skin, high in natural collagen and fat soluble vitamins for better absorption. Wild caught fish and skin provides omega-3s and bioavailable collagen to support skin and joints. Egg whites, rich in glycine, proline, and essential B vitamins to support GABA production. The key difference is whole foods come with the cofactors that naturally balance amino acid metabolism, making them safer for sensitive individuals. Not all supplements work for everybody. If you're dealing with unexplained anxiety, inflammation, or gut issues, collagen might not be your best friend. Instead, focus on whole food sources of protein that works with your metabolism, not against it. If this video helped you, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Let me know in the comments, have you ever noticed changes when taking collagen?